Hey everyone, welcome to a new video. Today we are going to talk about held items. How to get them, how to craft them, I will explain everything. Let's go. There are some codes on the screen as usual, but this time I'm going to make it different. Only three are showing because you can join my Discord if none of those codes are working. Join my Discord, the link is in the description, send me a message and I will send you a code for you. Also there's this app that my friend developed, it only works for Android and helps you not missing any events. We all know that the events of this game sometimes have some weird timings for everybody, but this application will actually help you out, will notify you when the events are happening. If you want to download it, the link is in the description. Held items are essential on your Pokemon, they are used to provide more damage, more survivability, depending on the playstyle that you want. For example, if you want more dark type damage, you have something like this. Or if you just want raw damage like a, a life orb, 30% more damage on any skill, but you lose a little bit of HP. There's a lot of playstyles. So let's take a look on how to get them. First method we have over here, it's the gacha. So on the gacha, held item gacha, you get a guaranteed purple or orange held item. If you want any of these that are available over here, feel free, you can go for it. Even though I only advise you to spend on gacha held items, if you are some kind of an early game, like you need some kind of held item to get you started, so a held item gacha is actually very useful. And as an example, I just bought 10 gacha coins, so we are going over here, open some held items, just so that you guys can see what can you get, how does this work. And as you can see, I got a quick claw. I actually did not have any quick claw, so I it can be useful, 15% chance to let the bearer move first occasionally. The second method is for the rechargers, sometimes it is available on a cash bundle like a limited offer cash bundle, there's like held items over there, or on the cumulative recharge which can get a little bit expensive, it's just one single held item, a legend that you can choose whatever you want. There might be other events with held items in the future, you just have to keep an eye on them. And the third method, the freest method of all, is over here on the master shop. On the master shop you can buy scrolls. As you can see, you need 1000 of this currency over here and for 1000 you can buy scrolls of any held item that you want. This currency is actually Pokemon League currency, so that means that you have to play over here the Pokemon League so that you can get that currency. We can see the rewards over here, this is the seasonal rewards and for example right now I'm rank 4, so I the, over there it says King but it's the strongest challenger, uh, whatever, same thing, is the top 5, so right now I'm getting 850 of those per day. And also when you do the battles, your daily battles, you also get a little bit in return. Now that we know how to get this currency, let's get some scroll and understand how this works. I'm going to buy this adapted uh, arrow scroll and then I'm going down here on the research, research and I'm going to the held item. On the held item you can see there's a bunch of scrolls. It says zero because I don't have any, you just have to click on the one that you just purchased. And now what happens over here? You have a 20% chance to craft your held item, but if you want to increase that chance, all you need is this beautiful sand over here. The color of the sand does not matter at all, it will not give you any extra luck. What matters is that you fill the bar, so that you have 100% success rate of getting the item. But before we continue, how do we get this sand? So first option we have over here, the expedition. Expedition, There, I have a video on it already, so there's a link in the description. And according to the amount of stages that you defeat, you have over here, for example, stage reward rewards and you can see you get multiple sands according to the stage that you defeat. There's also the battle pass over here and on the battle pass you not only get some golden sands because if you have the advanced pass purchased but even on the free versions over here you can see there's some free sands available. Let's go back to the research and let's go to the held items and over here did you know that you if you have extra held items you can actually decompose them. Yes, you decompose your held items and you also get sand in return. Not just that, do you see these crystals? Uh, these crystals can drop in some recharge events. Not just that as well, if you fail to craft one item, you get those crystals instead. So you don't want to fail the item, okay? <laughs> 
<laughs> Only do the scroll with a held item once you have enough sand. It's better to not fail the held item. And actually, let me just go ahead and do this. Adapted arrow scroll. That's something that I am trying right now to get. I'm going to craft it and I got a blue one. This is how it works. You have a chance to get between white rarity and orange rarity. So actually, let's go to the gacha. It's easier to see over here. There's all of these rarities of held items, right? And between each held item, each one gets a better effect. So for example, let's take a look at this magnet. This magnet gives a uh, 7% uh, more damage to electric type attacks. Then I go to the blue one, 10%. Then I go to the purple one, 15%. And finally to the orange one, 20%. So as you can understand, getting the orange one is always the best option. But sadly, you cannot decide what you will get. Actually, I just refreshed the store. Let me see if there's anything over here that I want to buy. Uh, focus Sash. I am interested in a Focus Sash, yes. I would be more interested in the Adapted uh, Arrow Scroll, but Focus Sash can be a good thing. Mm, okay, I'll take the risk. I'll refresh. A couple more times. By the way, I do have a couple of more refresh chances. That's according to the VIP level. Lower VIPs do not have this many refresh chances. I do have, okay, the focus sash over there. Do I have, oh, I have the adapted arrow. Okay, let's go. Let's go for the adapted arrow once again. And I go over there to the research held item. And on the adapted arrow scroll, once again, I can I can do the quick add if I want to. I can do the quick add, but what happens with the quick add is that this can actually add you more EXP than you need. So if you want to do it like manually, it's probably better for you because you don't waste EXP this way. So I'm going to craft and I got another blue one. As you can see, it's luck based. There's nothing you can do about it to increase your luck, very sadly. I'm going to my inventory and as I can as you can see, I have multiple blue ones. Now, there is a thing that might come in the future. There's a thing that might come in the future, which is combining held items. It's supposed to exist. I don't know. I I, I feel like it might be bugged for, for some held items. If I go over here to the normal black belt, it, it says collect three to compose black belt. So technically it's like we should be able to collect three held items to upgrade it. Some held items this is working. For example, if I go to this C essence, this tiny C essence, I can actually click on use and combine it and if I have three of those I can make one normal C essence. C incense. Hmm. Don't mind my typo, it's okay, but you get the point. I feel like it's a feature that should be working, but it's not working yet. That's not working right now for some reason. So for now, while we don't have that feature, all we can do is honestly just keep getting new scrolls and keep trying until you get the legend held item that you want. And for those who think it's impossible, it's not impossible. I actually got two legend held items like very quickly, like this toxic orb and this life orb was like two days in a row. I got these two legend held items. So it's not impossible. It may take some luck. Yes, but it's not impossible. But this is it for the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. As always, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys on the next video.